Hello and welcome to this new video on my channel of to office in this video we are going to be talking about how we can copy down drop down list to other cells below like we have a drop down list here in cell C2 and I want to copy to the cells down in one of my videos I explained the method to create a searchable drop down list without the latest filter function of Microsoft 365 now it's not like I don't like these latest functions of 365 but this is to cater to mass users I always try to come up with a workaround without the latest functions so let's quickly see how we had created that searchable drop down list here I have created a formula of filtering data like if keyword is Z then it will filter all the data containing Z so for that I did extract with search function and then with small function I segregated all those things and finally with the index function I populated all those values I will not discuss at length about that so if you haven't yet gone through that video I recommend you to go through that first so this is the drop-down list that I have with me that I have created now this drop-down has a speciality that if I type anything like uh, MICH then it filters all the text that contains the keyword MICH now I want to copy this drop down to the cells below so if I try to copy this by control V what happens see see here we have uh, entered the keyword MICH and it filtered accordingly now I want to key in a keyword like Z and want my filter to work accordingly but it doesn't so we saw this method of copy pasting does not work in fact it throws the filtered list that we had obtained in the mother drop down list that means whatever there is in this list like three values of Michael it gives me the same result now how to get rid of this now there can be two ways from here one is whatever you want to search in this column say C4 first key in this one like T I want to search and when it filters then I will again type T here and try to filter my list but it won't be the smart approach now let me tell you something about cell function this is cell function there are various information type and the reference so if I select this contents and I give the reference to like C15 what happens it gives me zero now whenever I type anything like Tom the same value will be reflected in connected cell as well like Z the same thing is reflected but this was the case when I provided the reference so what if I provide no reference just contents as the reference is optional parameter optional argument I can leave it to here and see what happens it will throw me a circular reference error I will ignore it and press OK now what happens we type anything in any cell like ABC and that ABC is been reflected in the cell where I have applied the formula X Y Z and you can see the same value is reflected in the cell there so I'm going to exploit this feature of cell to my drop-down list so what I will do I will first remove filter from here okay delete it and what I will do I will type a formula here the same formula that I just talked about cell and contents and press enter now I will simply apply the drop down list here I'm going to data menu um, list the same one that I have used F3 drop down okay now see if I press Z here it filters the list accordingly say if I say Michael MICH it filters accordingly but you can also observe that 
the same value is getting reflected in C2 which is the mother drop down list. So that's it in this video. Hope you liked it. If so, don't forget to subscribe, share and do press bell icon so that you receive notification of all new videos. Thank you for watching.